Hmm. Huh. How should I throw myself out a window today? Let's see. Well, I could just continually see, slap myself. Or I could get up, make a pot of coffee, and watch five mysterious creatures. Caught on tape. That wasn't good enough. Good day, everybody. This is Swain Dragon Bear, and today we are going to be watching Five Mysterious Creatures Caught on Tape by Nukes Top 5. It was released nine hours ago. That means it was released today. You know, I'm beginning to see a pattern here. I really enjoy Nukes Top 5. So, you know, if you guys want to watch this video, the link will be in the description. Uh, I was supposed to upload another video today. Uh, but I can't really find out a way to get it across or anything like that. So I'm going to have to think that one through and hopefully not kill myself doing it. But anyways, we are going to be watching Nukes Top 5 today. I've already said that. I'm sorry. My bad. My bad. I'm so sorry. I'm sorry. But... So let, let's let's uh let, let's do that right now, please. In camera. Bye. Okay, seriously, somebody press the stop button. I don't see anyone doing it. Top five mysterious creatures caught on camera. Something's in the yard. For several weeks, Maddie and her husband have been hearing strange animal-like hisses and growls from their backyard. Gee, from the title of this, I thought it was going to be out in the street. Okay. You can cut it there. Please. Even more bizarre, she says that she and her husband have also experienced some random property vandalism including several heavy yard ornaments being thrown around or smashed. And, uh, I don't know about you, but that angel seemed pretty intact. It just seems like it's been sitting there a while, reading that same book. Somebody give it a different book. Might be bored. I'm just saying. Their neighbors have had similar creepy experiences. Local police have been called to the neighborhood several times after property has been damaged, including a large bush being ripped from the ground by someone, or something. On this particular night, Maddie hears strange animalistic sounds outside her house and decides to grab her video camera to investigate. This is what she found. Hearing the craziest noises. Listen. What? I'm sorry, I can't hear you over the traffic. I gotta check this out. Get you, my pretty, and your little dog, too. Where the f did it go? What the? F Hello? Anyone there? The f oh my god. Oh, 
thought I heard those noises again. Man. That's not really creepy, it's just stupid. See, now if I hear something, I get the fuck out. Alright? See, if I heard things in my front yard making those kind of noises, I'm not one to usually just go see what it is. No, I'm that kind of guy who shuts the door and says, GO THE FUCK AWAY! I heard him last night. Now on first viewing, Maddie didn't notice anything out of the ordinary in the video. But after re-watching the footage, she noticed this. Some strange creature seems to duck behind a tree as Maddie's camera light passes by. So, what do you think this is? I think that is a creature who is more scared of humans than as humans are scared of it. It's seen the light and it was just like, fuck you! Is this some mysterious creature tearing up the backyards of suburban homes? Or just some random vandal? See, now to be honest, I think that creature is just really pissed off because did you see the kind of car these people ha have? And the kind of house they have? No wonder it's destroying all the property. It lives out in the middle of nowhere and you guys have all this nice shit. The Creature in the Dark On an Iraqi YouTube channel, two urban explorers named Kazim and Munir explore creepy isolated areas that are said to be home to strange creatures, spirits, or animals. I'll leave it to you to decide which particular category this encounter fits into. In a wooded area, Kazem and Munir see a strange dark figure with glowing eyes and teeth before they both lose their nerve and simply run away. I thought that was just a black panther. Hmm. I think I'm good on that one. I don't want to go in there. Ever. <laughs> So did the two explorers discover a mysterious creature? Or is the video just an elaborate hoax? Let me know what you think. The Skinwalker Scream This video was sent in to me by so many people that it would be unfair to credit just a single person. So here are all the very nice people who suggested this video. So Dylan Anderson was hanging out in his friend's backyard which happens to border the fence of an Iowa State Animal Preserve that includes a dense forest. He hears strange sounds from the darkness and begins to record. So I'm up at the ridge line right now about the, where the fence is at. And so behind this fence over here, there's a wood line. It's about 9.48 in the, in the night. So we just heard it scream a little bit ago. I don't know if I can... I don't know if you can see past this, but so behind this where I'm pointing right now, there's the, there's a forest back there, and that's a pretty big forest. It's, an, it's a state park. So there's nothing that's back there, and it's protected, so I don't know. But we're back here, and there's, there's this fence right here that protects our, or the, my friend's yard, where we're at right now. And from that, I don't know what you'd call this, but there's a pasture right here with a bunch of trees. You can't really see them. I don't know if you can see that tree or not. Can you see that tree right there, that, that fern, right? Right there, that's a fern, and there's a bunch of other ferns all around. And it gets more dense as you go back. But what happens is this creature comes up against these this fence and it jumps this fence. And it was standing, we think right in this where I'm standing right now, and my friend's inside right now. But I'm getting this footage. And mm -mm. I don't want any. Move the fuck on. Did you hear that? That was f***ing it. Oh, f***. This, I'm out. this. So did Dylan catch the howl of a mythical skinwalker? Or some other creature? 
Is the video a hoax? Or could this just be some other strange animal lurking in the forest? One thing to note is this odd light in the trees that seems to jump to the ground just as the bizarre howl is heard. And... Did you hear that? Some YouTube viewers have suggested that this looks like a strange glowing eye. But what do you think? Bigfoot. Now no list of mysterious or strange creatures would be complete without a Bigfoot sighting. This clip comes from Central Oregon, where a group of teenagers say they spotted a strange creature walking through a field, alternately switching from crawling on all fours to walking on two legs. Oh, there it is. We've seen this thing before. Dude, what is that? A Yeti. I'm not kidding. That thing's... We've seen it multiple times. Oh my god. It's coming over here. It's coming. It's coming over here. Go inside. Oh my god. Oh, it went, it went down again. Oh my god. What is that? Oh my god. It's... Someone get the flashlight. Go get the flashlight, Eric. Holy What the is that? Nobody, everybody's inside. It's behind the bush again. Behind the ridge. That's gotta be what that sound is. A what? I can my It's behind the bush over there. It was That is pretty cool. Thumbs up. I have no idea what I'm doing anymore. It's definitely on two legs. Yes, it was Did walking. Walking. Holy. Holy. Yeah, that's my light. It's not hot. Yeah, turn that off. It's right there. Oh, right yeah, there. I see it. It's right there. Oh, there it is. Yeah, you're on it right now. Right there. You see it right there? It's huge. See it over there? Right there. You see it walking? Dude, that's on two legs. Watch it. Get the, can get the flashlight on it. Everything is fine until the teens try to deliberately provoke the strange creature. It doesn't work out so well. Hey! Hey! Oh, that's a oh, oh, You know, I hear they're all dead. That's what you get for trying to provoke, not prevent, provoke, you know, Bigfoot. You, you don't, you don't ever piss off a guy that big. It never works out in the end. Uh, unless you're really small and you know karate. Which I'm pretty sure this generation does not. <laughs> well, it's, it's a person. They're messing with us. Oh, yeah. This isn't a game. No one's messing with us. Flashlight on. Eric, turn the flashlight on. If anything, Eric's playing a sick joke. That looks just like you. Oh, it's getting down again. Fuck is this camera guy doing? He sucks at his job, okay? You have one job to aim the, to aim the camera at the creepy suspect. And what do you do? You aim it towards the sky and go, Oh, it, it's a guy in a suit. I bet it's a guy in a suit. I, I bet. <laughs> Aim the camera one direction. Okay, you see you see what I'm doing? I set mine down on, on some video games. And this is all you have to do. What are you doing? You aim it at him for about 30 seconds. And then you decide to aim it up. Why? Is the sky more interesting than Bigfoot to you? Is there something in the sky as well? Or did you see a fucking UFO? What are you doing aiming aiming I'm disappointed in you. At first, the creature charges them, which terrifies the entire group. But after that, it simply continues on its way. So, is this a mysterious creature? Is it Bigfoot caught on camera? Or just an elaborate hoax? You make the call. 
Backyard Goblin. Sebastian Acosta of Miami, Florida had heard a few strange noises outside of his new house, but he didn't really think much of it, assuming it was most likely some small animal. Shortly after he moved into the home, he decided to film a video to send to his parents, showing off his new house. When he reviewed the video, he found that he had caught something that he never expected. According to Central and South American legend, this creature would be called a duende, which basically translates to a goblin or a troll. Sebastian Acosta's story actually became so popular that it made its way onto Telemundo News. But what do you think? Is this some strange creature caught on camera? Is it fake? Or is it simply a very bizarre looking animal running along the tree branch? It looks like a red blur skedaddling its way on home. You gotta think outside the box. The red blur is way more terrifying. Well, you guys, that's all I have for you for today. So thank you guys so much for watching. If you liked it, be sure to click that like button down below. Let's get this video up to a minimum of 20 likes. If we can get this video to at least 20 likes, I will do a part 12. <clears throat> Last time I was asking for 25 likes and I, I didn't really get it that far. It's just I, I didn't really know what else to do. That and I really like making these videos. So I, I at least require a minimum of 20 likes in order for a part 12 and I'm really hoping that you guys get it there because I really want to make another one. So thank you guys so much for watching and I will see you guys in the next chilling episode here in about three to four days. I'm just joking. It probably won't be that long. Hell, if this video gets 20 likes tonight, I'll make another one tomorrow before I go to work. See you guys later. <laughs> Ha 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 ha!